Hi, good morning. <clears throat> I figured for my mixed media, I'm gonna use the mat that I bought. Like, oh, you see my ice mask <laughs> right there? I have a headache, I have such a bad headache. But however, I bought this, I think two years ago, maybe even more than that, but a couple of years ago, never used. As you can see, this thing is still on there. And I don't even know what this one is for. Do you, I don't think you keep it on it. Is it just like to protect this? And why? <laughs> I don't know. Why, why would you protect this like that? Is there a use for this thing? Oh my God, it's hard to peel off. Oh, I think you just put it back on. What? Do you just put it back on every time? I don't know. Please let me know what this one is for. Please, <laughs> please. I have no idea. However, you know, I always wanted the big mat, but then I thought, you know, it's going to be, it's not even shiny. Maybe I could afford one. But then what do I do with this one? I had the problem that I was thinking um, that it's going to be reflecting here, but it doesn't. I'm talking too much. I want to do mixed media in a book. My husband tested positive for COVID yesterday. By the time you see that, hopefully he will be over it. But, you know, it's it's hard. It's hard for me because he had his heart attack and wolf replacement and quadruple bypass and god knows what he has asthma and whatever and it's just it's just hard very hard for me so i'm like i'm stressing out and i feel like i'm on the verge of an anxiety attack the whole time so i'm going to do something oh did i toss oh you see i need to go to my trash again because i was just thinking i need something I took out my trash. No, I didn't have much stuff in my trash, and I think I tossed my glue stick in the old trash that I took out. I need something that is round. I have this. I have this. This is good. And then I need something that is round, but it's bigger than this. Oh, but yeah, it is definitely bigger than this. Let's try it out. <laughs> Ooh, that smells. Okay, I think. I think I would be fine with that. I just want to use mixed media. I want to use paints. And I'm thinking about maybe like green, blue, purple. I don't know if it goes together, but I would like to try because I have a journal in mind. Or maybe even purple, pink, blue. Does that work? Who knows? Please, if somebody knows, because I, I, I do not know. <laughs> <laughs> what did I say? Pink? Or should we put some green in the mix? Let's put some... That's apple green. Do I have a pastel? Crisp green and some other green. They look... To me, they look exactly the same. I know there is like a slight difference, but really, they, they, they do look the same. And I don't seem to have... I have Key West. I don't know if that's green. Let's try this out. Okay, I just want to play. That's all I want to do. How do I do that, though? I have no idea. Oh, see, haven't used it in a while. In a long time. Let's shake them up. They are from Walmart, and I think Michelle got them, I don't even know, years ago. <laughs> and I have been using them. As you can see, they are open. A bunch of them aren't even open yet. So, okay this i don't know is this gonna be like enough not enough how do you do that I, oh i think i might need more than that but i'm thinking of just ooh, how cool is that i wish it was the lines were a little more um a little wider but they are not so we're just going to do it this way oh i love this color and now i'm thinking I'm not good. I'm not gonna waste all of that. I need something to pick this color back up from here, you know. So what? Oh, I have this other book that I actually prepared. So I'm gonna try and kind of, you know, take the color off in whichever way it happens. On this one, and then I would also like to maybe. Maybe I'm just gonna go with my fingers. How about that? Oh, maybe I should also put some 
I did all and all of it in the same color. Maybe we need different colors. Who knows? I don't. <laughs> I have no clue. I have no clue what I'm doing, okay? <laughs> I think this might need more than that. Uh, what am I doing though? Oh, I was just trying to put some finger painting on here. And then I'm going to take this one and see how this is going to work. And I just want to go kind of inside of it. And loop. <laughs> I think it looks really cool. One more here. And then I do have another one. This is washi, washi roll leftovers, you know? So I'm going to go here and I'm going to go here and then I'm going to go here. And where else? Right here. And I think maybe right here. How about that? And more right here and right here. And I think I need more of this. So do the color match? Do the colors match? <laughs> I, don't, I have no idea. I'm not quite sure what I'm doing anyways, but I'm going to just go ahead and put my finger right in there, in the middle of each of them. I will put like a little, I don't know, it's just taking my mind off, you know, and I like to make my fingers dirty, believe it or not, except for when it's glue. I really don't like glue on my fingers, <laughs> but other than that, I think it's cool. <laughs> We could, like, go around it when it dries. Yeah, that would be possible. Should I make a couple of each? Or should I just leave one? Oh, it's going to be... Maybe I should have ripped them out first. But it's not really like that. Okay, I made space on my floor. Believe it or not. <laughs> Believe it or not. Let's see. Can we get more of this out here? Do we need water? Do you put water on that? Probably not, huh? I wish this was a little wider. That's that's all I'm wishing for. No, I'm wishing for a third hand. That would be better than anything else. I've been wishing for a third hand, I think, for seven years now. And I have never gotten one. I must be naughty. I must be very, very naughty. If there will be barking at some point, I'm just preparing you. Michelle is on her way home. She had a doctor's appointment and I'm assuming she doesn't feel too well afterwards. Even though she was planning to go to work, but I don't think she she will be. Okay. And then I'm just gonna kind of whoop, 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 you know, do this on this page. And then we get some blue all over it. You know what's the problem with me doing things like that? I'm very bad at um, just randomly doing something. I, I want to have a structure <laughs> to where the color goes. <laughs> but as you can see, I'm trying to just not to. <laughs> I'm trying to just randomly <laughs> do it wherever. <laughs> and not pick, you know, blue, red, blue, red, <laughs> green. <laughs> just trying. I think it's good. It's supposed to be mindfulness. That much we learned, right? Or I learned, or I was supposed to learn. <laughs> I was supposed to learn in my IRP. So, you know. If I didn't learn it by now, after what? I don't even know. I think I have done 16 weeks of DBT now. But then again, I read online and it says like it's a nine month program or something. So I'm still good, right? But it's my last chance because, or it was my last chance because in 2023, we maxed out of pocket and that means I don't have to pay. Other, otherwise I could not afford this. I don't know how people afford that. I truly don't. It would have cost me like, I don't know, $10,000. Who is going to go <laughs> and do it for $10,000? I wouldn't, you know, maybe if I win the lottery, I would. If I won the lottery, I would probably just live there in this program. I would do it all the time, you know. Okay, I think I have enough. 
of this. Okay, let's do some blue right here as well, just because I have leftover. I can probably use it for, for a different kind, but you know, I'm just gonna do some blue because I feel like I'm going to do these three colors and I don't care if they mix like on my finger or here or whatever. I'm not about to use a different finger. Oh, I have wet wipes here. Well, they are dry, <laughs> but I can spray them with water. Okay, so this looks beautiful. I'm going to go with the fine liner around all that later. Hopefully it dries by then. But I have 33 minutes to play. Well, 20 more. 23 more. So I'm done with this. I made this. And I made this. And what is... Oh, it's just a piece of paper that I wanted to turn around. Okay. What do I do? <laughs> We could do some swirls. You know what? What I'm going to do is I'm going to pick up this, whatever is here, and I'm going to put this aside to dry a little bit. Oh, yeah, my fingers are going to be so good now. Let's just do this. Okay, if I just lay you on there, are you going to be okay? You know what I lost and never found again? My brayer. <laughs> I'm... I need to buy another one because now I can oh, look how cool that is. <laughs> now I can't use a brayer, right? Because I lost it. I just cannot find it. It's it's terrible. I've been looking for it for years. So I wonder if maybe somebody took it, like my husband or my, my daughter, not knowingly what it is, put it in the garage or did something with that. But in my garage, I'm, I'm not going to find anything because... Whatever is in there, oh, you know what I can do? Whatever is in there belongs to my husband and daughter. And there's just a lot. And I'm not gonna go through all of that. I should buy a new one. I think that would be easier. Okay, I'm gonna spray some water so I can get the colors off of here. Okay, because I'm not about to waste this goodness. Oh my God. Those are going to be the prettiest pages ever, I'm telling you. They are. Okay, and I'm just going to get one that is completely has nothing on it. Okay, and I'm going to pick up as much as I can right here and right here. I guess it's a good thing to have a map, but I think it would be... Better to have a bigger one, you know. But for me, like I said, I just wanted to have a small one for once in a while because I don't do much mixed media anymore. There's my dry wet wipe. Okay, but what I do want to do is also some water coloring. And let me see. For water colors, I think I'm going to put you away. For watercolors, for work. Oh, I have these, but they are all kind of different. I don't like that. Okay, I'm just gonna use my my watercolors. I guess I don't really need this anymore for watercolors, or maybe I do. Who knows? I need a brush. What kind of brush should we use? My favorite brush? I don't have many brushes, but this one is a makeup brush. And I did prepare two water things because they say dirty and then clean. So <laughs> let's see if, if I can do that. <laughs> dirty and then clean. <laughs> okay. And here, what do we pick? Which colors do we pick? Because I want to kind of make something later. This one doesn't really have a pink one, I can tell. Why doesn't it have a pink one? And how does it go? I think I'm going to pick this one and then the fourth from here. And then the first from here. Can you remember? <laughs> could, could you remember that much, please? <laughs> let's see. Oh, let's do this. What did, I, what did I say? The fourth and the first. Because people do that. They activate their watercolors. 
I, I have seen it. <laughs> I have seen it. So I want to kind of make, ooh, this is a, like very, oh, what am I doing? Oh, well, I'm doing this, I guess. Kind of make squares with this. But that's a very bright color, if that makes sense. I'm surprised there is no pink. I don't know why why is there no pink. And I'm gonna use a fine liner on that one later too. So now we go like dirty water and then we go clean water. <laughs> At least that's what they told me to do online. You know, I watched the video and then I saw somebody do that and I'm like, ooh, totally. Totally gonna do that. I kind of want the shape of a square if possible. Okay, girls and boys. I don't even know if the colors match. I never know if colors match and who cares, right? All colors are pretty, so they all match. There you go. You know what? What I wasn't doing, I should just clean up the brush on the side first because I love the pages I made with just random colors on it. So there's gonna be a lot of pages. What else am I using? I'm using this green and I'm making another square right here. Oh, I love it. I love seeing colors. You know, I'm, as you can tell, I don't really use many colors in my life. <laughs> my life is not very colorful. But that's okay. Okay. So whenever this dries, I'm gonna use a fine liner on it as well. Oh God, my room is gonna be something. Okay, should we do two of these right away? Should we try some different colors too? What are pretty colors? I would say the yellow is pretty and then the violet is pretty. And then we're gonna use this one. How about that? Okay, the yellow is pretty, the violet is pretty, and this one is pretty. We're gonna do just the same thing, okay? Or should we just go to something else? I don't know. I wanna do another one with the different colors. Let me see. The yellow, I said, is pretty. So let's do the yellow. Just a little square. So if you're only doing like one thing, one certain type of crafts, I would encourage you to try something new. You know, I think it is therapeutic. It's good. And then you might fall in love with something new too. Okay. And then I go to the purple. Ooh, a lot of purple. Ooh, that is like, it's violet. It's not purple. But it's a lot of color. I don't even need to go back. You see that? <laughs> I don't even need to. And there is a lot of color, a lot of water left right here. <laughs> Alrighty. My book is going to be so pretty. I'm making like two books in one. So. Oh, I forgot to do it in the dirty water first. Now both waters are dirty. <laughs> what do I do now? What do I use though? Should I? Oh, I don't know. I think I want to use something different. I want to use this. I'm going to get the color from here. And put it on here. Can I mix myself a pink? It should be possible somehow, right? How do you mix yourself a pink? Let me know. Oh, well, it's still kind of clean. And I think I want another green. Right here.
take some off just because I don't need it to be that queen okay okay I love it loving this let me rip this out I, maybe I should rip them all and just lay them on top of each other but I feel like I don't know <laughs> I feel like it's easier this way okay put it on the floor what else can we do oh we could make just circles same thing but with circles and I'm thinking about trying maybe just different colors let me spray right here just in case because we want to appear professional right and I'm going for what am I going for I think I'm gonna go for this blue I'm trying to look up here what am I going for <laughs> this blue oh no didn't I say circles girl I did make a circle out of it <laughs> make a circle out of it now yes see I can totally totally make circles there you go that's a circle <laughs> that's not a really good circle but there's no good or bad it's not your traditional circle let's say it this way okay so I did that then I will jump one one over oh circles right here and right here and right here and right here nice there's so much left on the brush gee the blue is really colorful and then mm, I jumped one over so let's jump another one over Will I have enough to jump? <laughs> I don't know. I want to make four. Circle, 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 circle. Oh, I love it. Circle and circle. And this one has a lot. Okay. Let's do another page here too. Oh, I love it. And if the water doesn't look too bad, I'm totally going to use it to dye some papers when I'm done here. Okay. Which one did I use? One, two, three... Is this still blue? I guess we'll find out. Yeah, it looks blue. <laughs> it's just different shades of blue, you know? Circle, 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 and circle. Okay, I have to keep an eye on the clock because I only have 10 minutes left and then I will have to take a break and delete some stuff. I should have deleted it prior, but you know, First, I need to find stuff to delete. That's the problem. Because I pre-film and then, you know, I don't want to lose. I lost the video and, and this is so annoying. And <laughs> you know what? Today, was it this morning or last night? Well, last night was this morning too. Sometime after midnight was anyways. However, I watched Gail and she was so upset because she lost the video. And I was like, I feel you, girl. I feel you. One, two, three. Mm, could I do that? Yeah, let's do that. Let's jump here to the rads. I truly don't know if I, I will use it. I will, probably. But I don't know. And my journals, because it's so colorful, but I want to. I want to use more colors. That's, that's the thing. You know, I want to use more different things, not just colors. But just try something new, like this, for example. So just make some homemade artsy paper, right? We're making homemade artsy papers. Oh, that's Michelle. Okay, let me do this. What's wrong with her? She can't open the door. Something is going. You know they look all same. And once again, I did my dirty water here. This should look different because this one is orange. Yeah. Okay. Oh no, I forgot to clean it off. It's fine. Okay, we did circles. Did we do two different circles? Yes, we actually did. 
I, but I really also want to do a green one. Oh, I can't rip it off. It doesn't matter. Let's take that. Okay, let me move my card out of the way so I have more floor space. Let's do a green one and then probably call it a day just for now. Just for now. Until I delete the videos because I want to continue. Let's do this. I think this is olive. It does, it says yellow green, but it kind of looks like olive to me. Okay, then we gonna jump one over in here. Oh, this is so much darker. <laughs> Look how much darker this is. You okay? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Brownie went to Michelle's room. She had a doctor's appointment, so I asked her if she's doing good, and she is. Okay, thank goody she is. Oh, what is this? This completely different writing. It's okay, we can use a different writing, right? It's interesting. It's a different font. All right. <laughs> I have pink water here now where it was supposed to be. Not pink. Oh, what do I use? Because now it only got brown. I think I'm going to go back to this. Because I don't want brown. I wanted everything in kind of the same color, just different shades. It kind of looks very similar to this one, though. Okay. All right, are we done with circles? Yes, we're done with circles. Dismissed circles. Whenever it's dry, I should come back and do my stuff. Mm. Now I'm thinking, I would like to, I just don't know which. I would like to make a couple pages that just do have kind of the same color. And I do not have, I wish I had like a white brush. But I don't, because that would be much easier, you know. But I, I just don't have a white brush. All I have is this. Would this work? Oh, you know what? Why not try this? Because I want some blue. And I might have some pink, too. I don't know. How many times do you need to do that to get color? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. Let's see what's gonna happen. <laughs> and oh no, <laughs> that definitely is not a good brush. It's too wide. You see, I should have done the squares this way <laughs> because this looks like a square for sure. Um, it's okay. I can still do that. I love how somebody, you see, was making marks in this book. This tells me that somebody was using it to learn something. And I love that. I love to know that. And now I'm using the same book. One of those days, who knows how many years ago. It could have been a year. It could have been 20 years, right? But somebody was using it to learn and was sitting there and learning from this book. Because this is like mathematics I read here. I'm not sure what this is about. I didn't read it. But now I'm here creating with the same book. This person didn't know what's going to happen to the book. You know. And I don't know what's going to happen to my creation in 20 years. Right? It might go somewhere or it might go in the trash. God knows. Okay. I'm just going to make a page like this. And I think it's cool, even though I don't like this brush. I do not like this brush. And I'm going to brush it off right here. Am I done with watercolors? I I'm probably am. Okay, I'm going to just brush off this brush. And then I'm going to rip out 
this because I'm not about to waste anything as we all know it's just how I am sometimes it can be tricky but sometimes it's all right how do you mix pink I want to know you know what I think I'm just gonna go ahead and do something else real quick see I'm keeping all of these because I like what's on them. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to get this one back out. And all I want to do is just make some black marks. And I'm going to take maybe this brush is better. I don't know. Let's see. I just want to do this. Do this all over the page. I didn't even dip it into water. You know that? Maybe I should. I just sprayed and I did not dip. Oh yeah, this one has like numbers. I see. There are numbers on this page. Okay. It doesn't have to be perfect. We are not about that. Okay, so I'm going to... I'm going to finish this. Doesn't that look amazing? Now I'm going to do a go ahead and do swirls on another page. Okay, I did this without you because, you know, my time is running out. I need to delete videos. And once this dries, I'm going to come back and finish this up with you together. So I'll be back in a second. Oof, I forgot to turn off my volume. It's been a couple hours. Uh, these dried and I slept because I didn't sleep last night at all. Look at these. <laughs> Even these ones that I took off here, they look really cool. It's on my finger painting things. I chose those colors, you know, because you can choose different ones, of course. And this is just what I picked up, but it doesn't make the paper better, right? Look, it's just different kinds of papers. And I think it's amazing. And I'm going to use a marker on them as well. But I want to. I want to make this in different colors. Oh, did I show you this one? I don't know. I saw this one somewhere in one of um, journal flip throughs. And I was like, oh, I really like it. So I want to make this one. And I'm not sure. I think that's it. Maybe, wait, this is the same, isn't it? Yeah. Where was the one where it's like, it just, I think I went through it already. I don't know, I don't know. Maybe I just didn't see it. Maybe I'm blind. It's right here. <laughs> okay, okay. And um, this has dried too. By the way, because it has been a couple hours, it's still the same day at least. But you know, you get just like pages that you can use up. I did use up some already. And I actually did have another book where I put paint on, but I, I grabbed this one because it was next to me and it doesn't really matter. Right? So what I'm thinking of doing right now is, um, I think I'm going to use the paint first so it can start drying. Yeah, I do have blue already, so... I'm going to do this one, but with these three colors. And I don't know if they go together, okay? And I'm not quite sure. Hmm. Shall we use something like that? So we can fill it up with a little water too. Let's see how it's going to work, okay? I have no idea. Oh, I used this one sometimes. You see, I see gold, I see white, I see blue. So it was not a waste. <laughs> put it for some reason oh this one oh I know why because this one has coffee dyed water in it. so I hope it's it's not nothing bad though and I have to take out my I forgot my um, brushes in there okay let's see if this would work if I would just do some of this and I want to do them the other way around this time and a little smaller so four and then there will be f 
three and there will be three. So I kind of need half. Hmm. Why didn't I do this before? Okay. I kind of need half the page. To know where half the page is at least. Somewhat here. Okay. So I'm going to do four more right here. Oh no. It's okay. You see? It's kind of... Oh, I'm having a very hard time waking up. I've been up for a little bit now and I'm, I'm still not, my brain is not up or we'll like it. Should I make two? No. You know what? I'm going to make a full page with this paint. I think it's cool. Let's do this. It's not going to be a full page anyways. Whatever. Okay. Now I'm going to, I'm just trying stuff out. Right? It's good to try stuff out. I think I did too much water i put too much water in here it's very watery now but it's okay and then i will do one i want these to go in a different direction the text that's the whole reason why i'm doing that because <laughs> i want the text to go in a different direction because sometimes we use paper this way and sometimes we use paper this way and sometimes we like the text to be where we like it to be isn't it true? I'm just gonna do this right here. And I'm gonna turn the page in my book. I know this video is like just a video about mixed media. Just just a little bit of you know, you can craft or you can play with colors too. I love it. When I was done before the break. My fingers were colorful and I like it <laughs> because I did some finger painting and stuff, right? So I really did like it. Okay, I think these colors kind of go together. I don't know. That's that's me. You know, I know that there is something called a color wheel, but I don't understand the color wheel. You know, I know what it says, but I'm like, okay, <laughs> it's okay because <laughs> I'm just, you know, just don't know many colors, right? Okay, I like this. Maybe I should have done a couple pages because I would like to use the same colors, actually. Yeah, I would like to use the same colors. Hmm. Okay, so let's, how do we do that? How do we do that? We can put you aside here and then we can do two pages at once, maybe. This is cool. Those are very strong pages. Maybe I should have left them for something else. It's too late now. It's too late. And um, what do I want to do? I want to know where the middle is, kind of. Right there. And then I want the same colors. Because I'm thinking that I'm going to... Oh, that's a lot of color. I'm going to use them in my journal. Did I say, say that? <laughs> oh, no. I touched on that. This one doesn't want to really drop because the bottle is dirty, I guess. Um, these flow, but this blue one doesn't want to flow. You know what I want to do? I'm going to get some of this water because it's not... Well, it, this one is pink a little. And then I'm just going to drop in there. At least it's not brown, you know, and the brush is wet. So that's, I guess, a good thing. And now I'm just going to do circles, right? Right. I'm just going to do some circles here. Five. And... They don't have to be the same size. Five. And I think I'm going to do a whole page like this. Oh, yeah. I like this. I like this color. Yes, 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 please. I hope I have enough for a whole page. I think it was perfect. Let's get some more. My husband has been asleep all day. Like he has not left his bed since yesterday. 
yeah <coughs> now it's what 2 p.m oh no the color is gonna flow where's my where's my pickup piece of paper that i pick stuff up with this one i'm just gonna go ahead and put it on top here i did make a smooshie there but that's okay rip it off put it in the back and then i'm gonna rip off two more so the color doesn't pull it down with the paint the color okay now what do we have we have a dirty brush first of all that's what we have this is mud one of them is mud but the other one is kind of pink <laughs> because i dipped my pink brush in there that's why Oh, I didn't have anything on my brush when I went to this one. Oh, I see. There's a lot on it. I wonder how it's going to look like when I go with the marker. It should look good, right? Okay, what are we doing here? One, two, three. How about four? One, two, three, four. Yeah, I think four is a good number too. And they are going to be smaller. But I will be using more paper. And I, I want to use the paper. I could use it as a page maybe. In my book. I don't know. You know, I'm making... I am making a journal. After I make the journals that are in line first. <laughs> I didn't even finish my journals yet that I have started but of course I have another journal in mind already happens to the best of us right I think we are all the same kind of when it comes to this okay now there is some color left oh she's gonna remind me of what oh I have to order slippery elm I have been getting off my PPIs and I'm, I'm drinking Slippery Elm again. If you don't know what Slippery Elm is, it's good for your stomach. Like if you've got heart, heartburn or gourd or something like that, it's good for your stomach. I make a tea. Uh, not really tea. Okay, take my meds. There it is. I knew she's going to remind me of that too. Not really a tea tea. You just cook it so it gets like, I don't know, thick. The consistency of it will be thick, so it coats your stomach very good. So I do it every day before I go to sleep, and I have to buy more. Okay, this one's done. It's going to go to the side. You are done. You're going to do, well, not to the side, but on the floor. <laughs> One, two, three, four. And that's what I'm going to do. And I don't need them to be like the same length and the same width and the same anything. I want them to look random because random is not my strong suit. My brain does not like random too much. <laughs> it wants something. That's why I like numbers so much. I love numbers because numbers always make sense. You know? It's not random or anything. Okay, let's take it off here. And I'm going to take a little bit of muddy water. It's okay. But there is so much on the brush. I want to take it here, put it here. So did we do all of them? Oh, no. I think I had the pink one already. Nope, I had a blue. I had a blue one and I did a blue one again. I must have done another one too. Yes, so okay, I did everything. I think I did three of them. Okay, we're good. We're good with this one. <laughs> we almost used up the whole thing here. Now I want to. What do I want to do? I want to grab. I don't really need this anymore, but I guess I'm just gonna. I'm gonna see what's gonna happen. I need a sharpie, and this is ultra fine point. So I'm just gonna go around this whole thing kind of one two three times whatever you feel like and i'm doing it wonky wonky <laughs> i think twice is good should we try three times three times 
three times is good too. One, two, three. It kind of defines it a little more, I feel like. Okay. I have learned that if you use paint or watercolors or whatever, and you use like a Sharpie or a white one, whichever it is, it will make everything so much better. I mean, look at this. This and this. Such a difference, isn't it? This video is going to be 10 years. 10 years long, 10 hours long, hopefully not 10 years long because I have other things to do, but today it's really perfect. I'm trying to count <laughs> while I'm talking to you, I'm talking to you, my brain is counting and I know that I miss one or two lines because I start at the same spot and this is once again just my little OCD that things have to be how they have to be see I did more here I'm gonna try and go in the other direction <laughs> so I mess up my brain <laughs> there you go brain <laughs> I trick you <laughs> now you're like all perplexed like, what you doing girl I have no idea what to think anymore <laughs> Yeah, I have to try different things. I have to push myself out of this comfort zone. You know, this is one of the things that we learned in DBT too. You know, you got to get out of your comfort zone because then you stay stuck in there. And only if something feels uncomfortable and different are we growing. Look at this masterpiece. I love it. Okay. Oh, this is the one that I did here. Oh, circles. <laughs> Let's do circles. Same way. <laughs> That's good for me because I cannot stay straight for the light of me. I cannot make a circle. And this is good for me because then my circle is naturally wonky. <laughs> Look at that. Look at these circles. Oh my god. And they are all different sizes to begin with. I don't even know how many circles I'm doing. I'm just making circles. My face is all burning up. I don't know. I took a test. I do not have COVID, but I just don't feel good. I haven't been feeling good prior to that. I think this one I'm just going to leave as a color to each. And then with those, we don't need to do anything. More circles. Oh yeah, I like the circles. I really do. And here I really want to connect this one. But I won't. like therapy here <laughs> you know? when I was in DBT and we do we would do like assignments I would have a very hard time if I didn't know the rules or if I forget something and then I felt like I didn't follow a rule I didn't like that I like rules so that one thing I have to work on too because I feel like if you follow the rules, there will be no punishment, right? Oh, this says the butterfly effect. Mm, it's interesting, the butterfly effect. Okay, then I do have this one. And, oh, this one I have seen. What's her name? Oh my God. I knew her name. She does a lot of cards on YouTube. If you know her name, Shanuki, Shanuki Art, I think. I've seen a TikTok of hers where she she was just making circles around little circles like that. Everything I'm doing and making, I saw somewhere, you know? Well, not everything. We don't say everything anymore. 
We don't say always and never. So let's say a lot of things I am making, I saw somewhere. I think it's normal, right? This is where we get our inspiration to do things. And then what did, oh my God, this has to be random. So let's do it randomly. Let's try at least. She just, you know, did some random, random this. Was that random enough? I have nothing up here. <laughs> I hope that is random enough. Is it good? I think it's good. Really cool. This I want to leave as is. Or do I? No. I think I want to leave some pages in my journal. That's going to come out in like 2042 or something, okay? So don't expect to see this in a journal sometime soon. <laughs> Even though, who knows? Maybe I'm going to be Superwoman this year. And make a whole bunch of journals. My friend told me, I forgot who does that. That, um, you know, some, but I'm sure a lot of people do. What was this called? I forget. But you make like mass making journals. Like I do mass making with my junk journal envelopes or whatever. Y you mass make journals. You do the same steps again and again and again. And then you have like five or ten or whatever journals you decide to make. Whatever number. But to me it's like... <clears throat> and like I always say, it might be this way right now. But I might feel very different about it in a year or maybe just a month or two from now. But right now to me it just feels like... There's not much fun in this. I do want to have fun when I create. Like, even for my Etsy store, I make stuff. And if I feel like an obligation and I don't have my heart in it, I don't reproduce it anymore. I take it out of my stock. Because I don't want to make something that, um, well, I don't want to make something artsy or creative or whatever that doesn't touch my heart, that feels no good. You know what I mean? So, of course, we all work and then, you know, there's obligation. Not everybody wants to do what we have to do at work. And I understand that. But when it comes to art, then no. I've never followed any um, trends when it comes to art never done anything that I didn't want to do you know sometimes like YouTube will send you tips on how to improve your channel or whatever and they say look what gets views and make a similar video blah 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 I couldn't you know even if, if it would guarantee me views and whatever, I just couldn't. I can't make anything in front of a cam that doesn't belong in my heart. I don't know if that makes any sense. Okay, I think I'm gonna leave those like this. And you know what? It's been almost an hour, I think. But we made beautiful art. Let's see, let's take this one away and this one that we, but we made beautiful art. Look at that. And you don't use, you can use the whole page. You can fold it, you can put it in your journal, but you can also rip just three of them or this way. I would rip it this way because then you have get three different ones, you know? So I think that's amazing. Here, same thing, just rip it or two of them and just put it on top of your booklet or whatever, or just stick it somewhere or in the background or whatever, clip it or, you know, make a page once again, if you want to, if you want this to be like a half a page. I love it. Same here. I think I'm wondering, will I put this aside or I will keep them all together? I don't know. I will keep them all together because I'm not sure if these colors go with my journal as well. I'll put them here for now and then I will put them on top of each other. It's art. <laughs> Even this one. <laughs> it's nothing. <laughs> but it's art. It's beautiful. You know, just some paint, and this is like, I don't know, 
50 cents or a buck at Walmart. That's not much, you know, and it has been there for years. Remember, like, many years ago I made a video that Michelle got me, like, a whole bunch of, of paints at Walmart? Those are these, you know, they are still here. Didn't buy any more. <laughs> okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Don't I have something under my map that I was trying to flatten out before? I think I took it out. Oh, no! Huh, see? I forgot already. <clears throat> I have something here, but I'm going to put... I'm going to clean my mouth and put these under a heavy book so they flatten out a little bit. I think it's going to be easier to use. But yes, that's it. That's my mixed media project that I love so much. Look at that. Oh. Yes, I want to play and I want to do more mixed media. And um, I'm planning. Well, you know, you plan and God loves. That's how it works. But... I would like to do more, maybe every Monday, you know, just playing with some paints or inks or whatever, just playing, just playing, not really creating a journal or something for a journal. Well, I do, but actually just playing. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know what you were doing while you were watching. Maybe you created something beautiful too, probably, or even most likely. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Oh, you know what I'm thinking? Ooh. I think I want to splatter too. I think I'm going to go ahead. Oh, I don't know. I don't know, guys. So this, I feel like I want this to be my journal. And I did print some stuff and it has pinks and blues. That's why I used pinks and blues. And... What do we use like as an accent? Should it be? Should we splatter some what, black? Just a little bit, just for fun. I'm gonna splatter some black, <clears throat> just for fun. You don't have to, but I'm going to. I'll do one with you. I think this black is sealed. I have another black. See, I have two, and I don't know why. Oh, because this one is almost empty. I can feel it. It's okay. I'm just going to put it here on the side. If anything is going to come out. Yep, it does come out. Let's do uh, just a little more. And then that's okay. I can put some coffee dyed water in there. And I have this brush of Michelle's. And I want to try it out. I, I stole it from her, you know. Oh, I think I need, I need more water to be able to really splatter. <laughs> Oh, no, I have way too much paint in there. Now I'm going to take a book and splatter a whole book. I'm telling you. Will it splatter, though? I'm scared. Oh, I should try with something else. <laughs> Let's start small. Oh, oh, beautiful. Yes, I love it. I need to put it on the floor. I love it. Oh, yeah, it splattered by itself. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, this brush is so good. See, this way I can, I'm trying to splatter more on this part because this way I can use up the whole thing. Oh my God, love it. I'm thinking that when this is dry, maybe I should splatter something white on it too. Oh, scared. <laughs> That's scary. Oh, I splatter on my table too. Just a little bit. It doesn't have to be too much. But, okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to continue splattering all over the place. And once I'm done. Oh, that was a lot. That's okay. Because every time I dip the brush, I have to be a little more careful. When I'm done with this, I'm just going to take my book wherever I, I clean my brush. If I can find it. Oh, it's on the side here. And then I will splatter all of the pages there. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm going to do. Because I have so much paint in here now. Be careful. Whenever you start out, <laughs> you have to be a little careful. But I think I'm good. Yeah. Okay. You don't need to watch me do that for every page. So I'm going to say thank you for being here. 
and I'm trying to concentrate. <laughs> can you tell? I can talk and splatter. <laughs> Funny. Okay, thank you for being here. I hope you had some fun. And um, I had a lot of fun. I don't know if you can tell. First of all, I had a lot of fun. Second thing is, it absolutely took my mind off of things that are going on here with my husband. And me being scared to catch it too. And me being scared what's going to mean for him. But he has an appointment later today, a phone appointment. I don't think I'm going to have paint left for the book. Because I'm using up a lot of paint here. <laughs> However, he has an appointment later today. A phone appointment and um, they might prescribe him medication there is medication now for COVID. you know i don't know nothing about COVID anymore i don't know if there is protocol i'm not going to do this one i don't know if there's some kind of protocol what do you do how do you do do you isolate do you quarantine does everybody quarantine you know at the beginning everybody knew everything and it changed like every week <laughs> but we still heard something and now it's as if it's nev it never existed or it has never been bad, you know. Now you get COVID, you get COVID. Nobody cares, because <laughs> I called I called his cardiologist first thing his, this morning, and he was like, "Why are you calling me? Go ahead and call his GP." I'm like, "Okay, must be you know, Corona is not is <laughs> is not in the news anymore." Yeah. All right, I did it all with you. Let me finish up then, because now my hand's dirty, I feel like. Okay. Thank you so much for spending time with me. A lot of time. And I will be doing this again. I will be maybe making the same thing or maybe something different. But I hope you are happy and healthy. And I splattered all over myself, as you can tell. Oh, Jesus. All over. Everywhere. Yeah. When you splatter, definitely. Oh, I should make a box. I should get a box. Yep. I'm going to get a box maybe next time for splattering because then it has like walls and it's not going to go anywhere. However, guys, hope you're all healthy, happy, and enjoying your day. And I see you soon. Bye-bye.